Hello, Sonia Sanchez here. Welcome to the Sonia Show. Two brigades have been arrested after a drive-by shooting attempt on a police officer. Here today is Captain Bridge from that officer's precinct. Thank you for coming, Captain Bridge. Can you tell us more about the incident? Of course, Sonia. The officer in question was shot at while on patrol. I don't understand. Why would the brigades shoot at one of our finest? Excuse my French, Sonia, but that's because the BBs are low-life scum. Luckily, the officer wasn't hit and is doing fine. Yes, luckily. And how did you apprehend the brigades who did this? Those boneheads lost control of their vehicle and crashed. Ha, talk about instant karma. <laughs> Incredible. Now let's take a moment to look at the latest candidate polls. Looks like Tyrak is still the preferred candidate. In a nutshell, voting for Flores equals voting for violence. Don't vote for violence. Vote for Tyrak. As you know, the Sonia Show is very concerned about our youth who continue to mysteriously disappear. Let's view today's missing teen report. Remember, if you have any information, please call the Sonia Hotline. And that has been the Sonia Show. Transfer me out of you know where. My dad must have found out where I was. Get get the van keys from the cops. But you'll need to to distract them somehow. Then come back here. Thank you. Know how many times I've called for a tow this year? I don't. Guess how many times? Fine. Three times. Nope. Four, four times. Can you believe it? Don't, don't swallow any.
going on? Hello? Does anyone copy? Where'd that kid get to? That kid did this. She can't be far. I'll check behind the station. You gotta believe me. Please, please don't hate me. It's not my fault, okay? I'll go back to my father. Uh, to jail, and possibly... I'll, I'll get my dad to save you. I'll say... I don't know what I'll say. Look, maybe... Maybe you should rest. You'll feel better. Just... just try to get some sleep. And when you wake up, I'll know what to do, okay? <gasps> you hear that? See you in hell! going but they'll be back and with friends lucky we intercepted their comms check the van the girl must be inside please don't hurt us got a second kid in here you can but Zoe you should come with us wait how do you know my name wait. did my father send you Definitely not. We'll explain later, but right now, you two have to split up. You... You... You risk your life for me. Yeah, maybe. Zoe, we have to go! I, uh... I hope I get to see you again.
Okay, we all know the plan, right? Yes. Totally. Let's do this. Uh, guys, is it me? Or is that kid over there listening to us? Nothing to see here, kid. Get lost, kid. Where is he, Sonia? It's almost time. Well, I don't know. Maybe, maybe I insulted him one time too many. Look, find someone to film this, and now you know how important this is to him. Where am I gonna find a loser to... Hey! You there! It's your lucky day. Sonia has a job for you. Perfect! Then you're my new camera operator. Now get behind the camera. Time to make some effing magic. This is just a little puff piece on the pub, Cuddle Muffin. Nothing to it. We have a sec if you wanna, like, talk to me. I get my take on something important. Check, 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 check. How do you think they make me feel? They want to topple a system that's good to me. I don't like them at all. Thanks, honey bunny. Okay, let's go. We'll start with the intro. Oh, this is good with the billboard behind me. How do I look? Wait, I know. Amazing. Don't you dare frame my toe! Yeah, just like that. Three, stop zooming! Now, where was I? Three, two, one. Sonia here, reporting live from the site of Petria's newest oil pub where the Minister of Oil is moments away from a speech. The new pump. A I'm getting angry! Hey. Now, where was I? The new pump, a gift from President Tyrak, will soon bring riches to our already rich nation. And cut! I'm gonna be honest with you. You're the worst camera person in the history of camera persons. I don't got any cash on me, but I got something else. I knew you'd like it. It's a lucky charm. It's helped me. Maybe it'll help you too. Okay, sweetums. Now we film the minister. Get the crowd to cheer when he talks about President Tyrak. And boo when he talks about Senator Florence. Got it? That's what I like to hear, Chunky Wonky. Okay, he's approaching the podium. Film him. Hello, good citizens. We're here to celebrate the opening of this pump. Don't forget to take some close-ups. And what a beautiful and strong pump it is. Like our nation, like our president. Speaking of our president, let us cheer him to show our appreciation. What are you doing? Flores. Flores believes we should abandon fossil fuels and take away your jobs. What do you, the hardworking people of Petria, think of Lupe Flores? What? Don't you F with my career, Dumplin'. There's been a lot of talk of a brigade uprising, but am I worried? No, I've even let my teen daughter embark on a road trip. President Tyrak will keep our nation safe. Praise President Tyrak! Don't do 
stories like that. Well, it's about time to drive off in my limo. Like all good journalists do when they finish a story. Look, to sum it up, you sucked with the intro. But I had faith. I was once a poor dirty teen myself. But then you completely effed up filming the minister. And that almost got Sonya fired. Bad teen, bad. Guess what I'm trying to say is, hope I never see you again. Adam, let's roll. This is the campaign donation fund for Senator Flores. Care to make a donation to her run for president of Petria? Senator Flores, thanks you for your help. Goodbye and good day to you. Happy taxi, how can we help you today? We'll send a taxi to your location right away. Thank you for calling, Happy Taxi. Further, I should let you know that I have some anger management issues. Now you know. So, where are we headed today with Happy Taxi? Then just north it is. We sell scratch tickets if you're feeling lucky. Good luck.
okay. Now sit back and enjoy your ride with Happy Taxi. Let's see who's contacting me now. The Sonya Show! How did they get this number? Just a second. Damn. Piece of no good, son of a... I'm feeling much better now. Go on and ask me a question if you want to. I know all kinds of things. Yeah, hope they don't get to certain brigades before I do. Nothing. I saw you looking at my mags. Are you a fan of dinosaurs? I won't get angry if you aren't. Good. Speaking of dinos, have you seen this movie that came out? Gigantic Park. Hmm. I don't know if I believe you. Hey. Lean forward. I want to show you something. That's a portable VCR. Now I can watch tapes whenever I want. When GP comes out on VHS in Petria, I'll watch it every day. My daughter would have loved Gigantic Park. But she passed away. Well, bad things happen sometimes. But I'll make it right. And in the meantime, I won't think about that terrible thing that happened to her. I'd become very angry if I did. No. You should take a snooze. You're a teen and your brain is still developing. Sorry about that. I heard a noise earlier, like screaming. What was that? You're not lying, are you? The VCR is warm. You watched one of my cassettes. Which cassette did you watch? One is very private to me. Oh, I see. That'll explain the screaming all right. It's pretty hardcore. We've almost reached your destination. I hope you'll consider riding with Happy Taxi again.
Uh-uh. Chucks isn't open right now. Renovation. skinny guy go on but make it quick I win hand over those bills Robert well I'm out anyone else want to shut up this guy uh-huh not me Bob the bears man that had occupies of Satan <laughs> weaklings all of you but what about you kid we've got ourselves a contender young blood believe me oh you're not it's just that John's still living in the past Chuck serve this girl a martyr here we go you sure about that Robert our friend here is practically an adult aren't you Showing, young bud. It's getting late. Oh, young bud. You okay? You look a little funny. What did you put in that drink? The murder? Everything. Wake up. Wake up. Haha, <laughs> I see. Come on, I want to show you something. Something big. Welcome to the Brigade's secret hideout.
John and I were at the border in 86. The brigades have been around for many years. The transmitter is one of our biggest achievements. The police are looking for it, but they'll never get their hands on it. We have many teen informants. We're hoping one can cross and help us from the other side. We have something special planned for election day. Wait and see. Yeah, this. What's the kid doing here, Robert? The kid's political. Besides, aren't we on the lookout for fresh blood? See? She's not gonna say a word. Let me start with a big piece of news. Thanks to Zoe, we have intel showing that Tyrak was behind the collapse. Just like we've always suspected. You're just like us, kid. We tried to end his life that day but he set off the explosives on the peak. Each year, they set it off to prevent avalanches. Must have set off too much in 86. I have some other big news. I have a plan to rig a Tyrak billboard. We'll attract cops to it by broadcasting a fake signal. When they arrive, boom, we trigger the device. This isn't a huge move, but it's a good start and will send a strong message. Do I have any volunteers? That's great, kid. But I think we'll go with hardened brigades here. I'll do it, Robert. This isn't who we are. They're sending teens to the work camp, John. Protests aren't cutting it. And Flores sure as hell won't cut it either. Robert's right. We need to attack. Now. Alex, our little genius, will help us rig the device. If all goes well, he can build us something bigger and badder for election day. The kid's out, Robert. He doesn't want to be involved in this. We don't need Alex. We can find somebody else to do this. I'm telling you all, violence will do more harm than good. Funny, don't you think, kid? Funny because John and his girlfriend were the ones who drove the truck to kill Tyrak in 86. I've changed, Robert. Yes, you have. Look, we should vote and settle this right now. Who thinks the brigades need to be more aggressive? I don't. I do. I do. I refrain. I don't. I don't. I do. Free against free. Let's ask the kid. She's here after all. Mmm, that's why you brought her in. To vote on your side. Incredible. Kid, what do you think? Good. Then it's decided. The brigades will go on the offensive. Picked it up in the scanner. The police on their way. We all know what we need to do. Get in our cars and leave calmly. Kid, no need to worry. They'll never suspect you. Hey, kid, wanna play? We can put down some money if you want. What can I do for you, kid? Of course, kid. Nothing you know what kind here, of a bar this is. I'm on the front line. your money. Another game?
Mitch. With pleasure. You, drive. Don't look at us. Just do what we say, and you won't get hurt. Shut up and step on the gas! Our motor not starting outside the laundromat after we rob it. Humiliating. Uh, you think I don't know that, Stan? It's your fault, you know. My, My fault? Oh, that's rich, Mitch. You know what, Mitch? Maybe you should find another Robin partner. Well, uh, maybe I should. Like this kid. Fine, take the kid. She's clearly a criminal anyway. Hold on, hold on. Before we end the best Robin duo ever, let's take a deep breath. Yeah, we shouldn't rush into this. This is big. I know. Let's put the radio on. It'll help us forget about the laundromat. Good idea! A laundromat robbery happened about an hour ago. Ah, oh, jeez. Witnesses say the two robbers, both dressed like they were into S&M role-playing, argued the entire time. Though the suspect only made off with $72 in quarters, they are said to be armed and very dangerous. If you see them, please call the police immediately. We're laughing stocks. And Sonya reporting it, no less. Oh, jeez. Well, I guess that's it. Stan and Mitch are breaking up. Go on and partner up with the kid. Yeah, I guess that's it. Wow. Only one thing left to do. To be sure this is the right move and all. Give the kid Mitch's ultimate bank robin quiz. Yeah. Four questions by which Mitch evaluates your criminal mind. Get enough questions right and you and Mitch become robin partners. But don't, then Mitch and I have to... Uh, I don't want to spell it out. Question number one of the following, what is the best location to rob? The clock is, uh, ticking. Wrong. We don't even know each other yet. Let's try this again. What is the best location to rob? That's right. Not much security. And there's food. Though jealous, I will admit, I am very impressed. Question number two. When is the best time to rob? Yeah, that is the best time to rob. Visibility is low, and mysteriousness is high. Question three. What is the best getaway vehicle? Nope, because it's kind of, well, expected. Yeah, expected. That's strike one. Question four. The final question. What is the best thing to do with your money at your hideout? Is this your final answer? Yes, that is the best thing to do. We need to not explain why for obvious reasons. 
Wow. The kid passed. Uh, no, I've never even passed it. And it's my quiz. So I guess you and the kid are gonna partner up now, eh? Stan, hold on. Yes, Mitch? Though, the kid and I's Robin compatibility is through the roof. No doubt. I cannot imagine Robin with anyone but you. Nor I, Mitch. Nor I. Remember when we snuck inside that cab company? Yeah, I still can't believe the kid betrayed us. Come on, let's keep the car. Uh, and ditch the kid. Sounds good to me, Mitch. You hear something, Mitch? I did not, Stan. Stan and Mitch! and drinks? Can I help you at all? Kid, 
You've got to show more discretion. There are guards here who'd like nothing more than to arrest us. Can we trust you? Okay. You seem in good health. Maybe try crossing over the peak. There's a path to the right of the trucks. But be careful. One false step and that's it. I hope you find your freedom, kid. We'll be rooting for you. Wants to know. Maybe I can help with that. The important word being maybe. Fine. But this is against my better judgment. Just don't slow me down. Before we go farther, I'll need what we agreed on. This is a business. You don't pay, I don't stay. Come on, we've got some walking to do. to cross. I guess my night vision is non-existent. I have some money. Can I walk with you? I'll need more than that, kid. Come on. We need to keep moving. Yeah. So long. Hold up. That light ahead should be the guard I know. Stay here. It's him, but he's gonna want more. I know it. I'll call you down when the deal is done. Almost there. You kidding? That's what you paid for. been arrested. No one said it would be easy to reach the border, let alone cross it. For one journey that ends, others are only beginning. <laughs>